Let me get that. Hey there, where's your mommy and daddy? They're dead, mate. It's a very sensitive subject, if you don't mind. Hey everyone, my name is Mike, and welcome back to Lucius 2. We're going to be starting with a cutscene for Mission 2. Let's go. Lucius had to visit each floor one by one. The answers were there, but for now, he only had questions. Why did one of his followers decide to kill himself without the boy's blessing? Why was everyone talking about this small town called Ludlow? What happened there? Had the prophecy begun without him? The fourth floor had a library on it, newspapers describing better the events in Ludlow. The boy also had more followers on this floor and would soon be calling on them for answers. All right, so we're making our way to the next floor right now. We've killed enough people on the floor that we started on. Let's move on. So this game is not just about killing people and like doing Satan's work. We're trying to figure out what the hell's going on as well. Lucius has got his, ho his own um, story where he's trying to figure out why people are killing themselves, the followers, you know. Alright, so the objective right now is to go towards where the follower is. And the map indicator is pointing us in this direction. So this this AM floor is is pretty much non-restricted. You know, we can walk around as much as we want. We can even go in this guy's office. No one suspects a thing. Hey, Dr. Carson Hill. Alright, so this is the room with the follower in. It's locked. This door is not locked with a key, but somehow obstructed from the other side. Try to find a way to get the obstacle removed. Um, let's go in the rooms next door. To, that's locked as well. What if we go in this room? Is there anything we can do to kind of like get the obstruction moved? All right. So I think that, yeah, this is the room we're trying to get into. There's a um, air vent going through to this room, the bathroom. There we go. So let's close this door and let's pick up this. Let's knock this out the way. And we'll get the can again, see if we can throw this inside. It's amazing how these things make it all the way across to the other side. Alright, that's done something. What the hell is a strong can or a very weak broom, isn't it? It's just smashed it to smithereens. So this door should be unlocked now. Ooh, hello. And there's another dead kid. At that point, it became obvious that they were no longer following Lucius. However, in the followers' room, he did find a torn-out newspaper called Danvers Post with an article that described a new murder spree in a town called Ludlow. It seemed the two people were brought to this hospital. There was another man on the third floor. Maybe he has some more information. I mean, just the sound settings are very quiet at the moment. The, vo the voice, the tenor voice volume up is very low. It should be better. Because when the narrator talks, you can barely hear him. I can't, anyway. Right, Sister Mary. Maybe she knows more. I know Sister Mary's the one we were looking for on the previous floor, and she wasn't there. She'd been moved. So I'm thinking we're going to be trying to kill this sister. Are uh, you here to meet Sister Marie? Yes. Uh, sorry, kid. I'm not allowed to let anyone into her room. Hey, are you allowed? Anyway, I don't think she's too fond of children. After what happened with some kid upstairs, huh? Okay, run along there, little boy. Uh, some kid upstairs. To be here by yourself, kid. Uh, some... Wait. Shut up! I'm, I'm, I'm over here. Move it, move it. Move it. I'm not even in your line of sight anymore, mate. Leave me alone. All right, so that guy is obstructing our path now to get in there. And I think the key, yeah, you know, the door is locked, as I say. Or oh, the guard seems to have the key. This guy's the guard. Okay, so we need to kill this guy. Let's see what it says. Security guard assigned to guard the nun. He seems very restless. It seems like he's missing coins. For cigarettes. Oh. Seems like he's missing coins. Does it mean he's missing coins? So, is he, where's he going? Okay, it's the cigarette machine. So, he's, he knows he's missing coins. But he goes and tries to buy cigarettes with no coins. Is that right? Alright, have we got anything? We've got a wallet, haven't we? So that, he will be attracted by that. 
Also, if you if you equip items in this as well, like you hold them in your hand and float them, and um, people see that as suspicious because you know you you're holding a, a floating object in your hand, you know. So you gotta be careful equipping items in this. So we need to kill this guy. We can probably lure. Oh, look at that! It's an electric roof plate up there. So if we can knock that down, hopefully that won't spook him out too much. And now, oh, and he's that was good. That. That um, that was good enough. Okay, I was gonna try and lure him towards it with the wallet, but seems like he was just already standing there. So job done. So let's leave him in there. Hopefully, no one ever goes in the office ever. His keys. Open the door. Let's do this. Oh, there's one of those cross things on the wall. Um, let's throw this at it. And magically turn it around. Look at that position on that throw. It's amazing. So, Sister Mary. What do we do here? It just tells us that it's just first aid. What the fuck? <gasps> she's she's resurrecting him. No way can he come back to life. Shit, I need to get this done quick. Whatever we're doing before he comes back. There's a pillow. Can we kill her? Um, is that what, shit? What we're we doing? <laughs> That's hardly got any pressure on it. Oh! The animation there, what the hell? Near the nun's bed, Lucius read the religious writings. The prophecy of the seven trumpets. The writings explain how these events would unfold and bring rapture. The horned one would inherit the earth with one of his sons. What it all meant was still unclear. Eh. Uh, I don't understand right then, right? That was a cutscene, but it was ragdoll. And it wasn't very clean looking. <laughs> I don't know what that was. That was a bit bizarre, the way she died. Alright, it worked anyway. So, I need to go, need to go find the second son. See, none of these places are restricted, are they? This key, this is locked. 1091. See if anyone's got the key to 1091. I see we've got a visitor here. Here to see your grandmother, are you? My grand- what the fuck? Who mentioned my grandmother? One of the four nurses currently working on the north wing. I think she's holding that key, isn't she? The one that says next to 1091. That's the one we need to get through the door. Um, can we get that? Hey there, where's your mommy and daddy? They're dead, mate. It's a very sensitive subject, if you don't mind. Um, there's another thing over there. Should we just do that? Should we just throw the... Um, beans on there in case she does happen to walk in that direction. Actually, you know what? Oh, I'm gone. She's coming. Oh my god, these people are idiots! Don't they look where they're walking? I swear I've killed everyone with electricity in this game. <laughs> hey, phew! Oh, did I drop the key? Okay. Let's just leave this lady in here. Ah, I think when you pick things up, see the arrows on the on the floor? That shows you where you can use the key. It's a bit of a weird pathing system, though. Alright, so let's just, um... Oh god, we're on the other side of the door anyway. Did we even need to use those keys? Oh no, we were on the other side of that door. Okay, so we did, yeah. Second son in here. Is it another dead kid? What's going on? It's nobody here. His room was filled with candles. It was obvious that some sort of ritual had happened there. And no sign of the actual follower. But on the floor, Lucius found a map of the nearby area. With the town of Ludlow circled. I Lucius found a map. Did I? Do I have to pick the map up or... Does it just tell me like that's happened apparently? So it's got a map of Ludlow. So do we leave the hospital at some point? It'd be kind of cool if we can go outside. <gasps> Use. Oh, what's this? I can. Oh, yes. <laughs> Headline news. That's the objective. What the hell is the objective? I can barely hear the, the narrator talking. So 
that's the only way of knowing like what's going on. Okay, we need to go inside there. So our receptionist has the keys to it. Reception, reset. That's reception, right? Can we get off the bike? How do you get off the bike? Object is too far. Woo. Um. Oh, you can just click on it. Is that receptionist? Antenna. Very tidy looking for floor. Reception worker. Dislikes mess. She looks very tired. Looks like she is. Yeah, uh, I don't know what she's. What does that say? Can we look at her through? Oh, that's restricted area. So she's staying away at the power of coffee. So we know she goes to coffee like all the time. That's her like pathing. Do we have any pills we can put? There we go. There's some pills there. So when she goes back up front desk, we'll uh, go back in here. Open up the inventory. Get the pills. Put the pills in there. Step outside. Look at her through the door. And she may she's just had a coffee. I mean, she's gonna need a pill or a wee before she goes for another coffee, right? No, it seems not. She's just gonna go and get another coffee. Oh, she dang. Bah. Seems like she's died. Give me a kiss. Sweet. Um, that was for the room, wasn't it? Where we gotta go next? Yeah, so that's her little office. So I don't think anyone else goes in there to pick up some more pills in case we need them later on. Unlock. This is not restricted, this room, is it? So we can go in. Uh, Xavier Thompson, construction worker working on the library renovations. He's not so keen with his safety. Well, he's not so keen with safety, and it seems that there are a lot of dangerous things around the room. So I think there's something we need to pick up in this room, and he's like blocking the the way to go. Is he? Can we go around the other side? There's another door on the other side. I'm sure. I think it's the same key. Yep. Can we pick up the newspaper? The newspaper has an article about boy in Ludlow that was the soul as a survivor. Out of, of my way, kid. Um. Yeah. Okay, that's that's the objective complete, right? From the library, Bruce has found a newspaper that had part of an article torn out. The article was titled "Blue Murder Spree and Bangers," and on the same page you saw another newspaper explaining that Charles Wagner was in critical condition. In the chill isn't from the weather. Death approaching. I don't think we need to kill this guy, do we? But you know, there's an opportunity right there. And we are the son of the devil, so I'm gonna throw this at that and see what happens. Uh. I don't even know what that is. It didn't actually explode, it just Oh my god, look at it's pissing blood. Dead body, some reactions can be unpredictable to someone like this. Nope. Just give me that. So I don't know if there's are there are items to pick up in the game as well. That oh shit I'm dragging him shit come back in here oh fuck he's in the hallway come over here <laughs> um get out the way so if you look at the map is there anything else like highlighted that we could do in here because the objective right now is exit we, we're done I think for this mission because sometimes you see those little markers like the the Satan marks the six six sixes and um. Oh shit, I just realised, yeah, we, we're collecting these 666 things and killing people. We've got five talent points to spend. Oh uh, my god. I'm going to look into these before I actually do pick. I think you can only pick a limited amount of skills. Can't imagine you fully unlocking everything. So, um, we'll finish the level. We'll take our little trike with us. There we go. Total score minus 31. What are you talking about? How is that minus? No one suspect. No one like looked at me, or um, you know, spotted me in a restricted area. Done it quite quick. Twelve minutes. Total body count five. Oh, okay. Apparently, I didn't do so well in that mission. I thought I was done all right. All right, guys. So that's the mission complete right there, and we'll continue the next mission in the next video. So thanks for watching, guys. Excuse me, just burped. See you next time. Bye.